beautiful bird. Featuring North America's favorite hunting couple. This is the archer's choice. We're, We're back. back. That's scary, huh? Poltergeist. Do, 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 What's do, even do. scarier is, you know, waking up from a nightmare and all of a sudden you're back on TV. You're starting already, huh? I'm it's starting early. early. It's it's early in 06 and, and this is going to be a, a good time. We took a hiatus. A high what? Yeah, don't Did hurt, I say that right? Yeah, don't hurt yourself. Yeah, I better be careful. If I pronounce that wrong, it's not going to go over well. <laughs> no. Well, we, we, we're excited about this year's show. We've got lots of great footage and great hunts to go through. But one of the things that we want to tell you guys right now is that this is a preview show. Pre which means you. you're going to see a preview of what's to come throughout the season. In other words, don't complain to me later that you didn't get to see the actual shot on it because within the next, you know, because we 12 we, weeks, you'll see all the shots, we promise. It's funny because on every preview show, we've actually been confronted on the in internet, especially, and they're saying like, man, you don't show the, you don't show the errors. We were watching your show for the first time. You don't show the impact. We do. But a preview show is just a sample of what's to come. It's the excitement, it's the adrenaline, it's the real hunting. And it's the, the good, the bad, and, and, and the, the ugly. ugly. I knew that was coming. Yeah, <laughs> you, you loaded that one up. So let's so, just... So let's, let's get going. Yep. We got preview hunts of Manitoba monsters up yeah. at Ken Ganglers and caribou hunting up at Mirage. Mirage, and it's, you know, that hunt just keeps getting better, both it of does. them. It does. Okay, I can't stop, wait. stop, stop okay. talking. Let's go. Let's go see some previews. shot was slightly quartering into him. I must have hit the opposite leg or something because it didn't go through. Normally my arrows go through there. You remember the other year when she had to wear the bear hides because she shot the smaller bear? Guess who what? has to wear it this year? No way, girl. Yes. No way. Yes. No. Yes. Wait, and you'll have to watch the show. I believe that this bear is bigger than Vicky's, and we are done bear hunting for this spring. When the get them when the getting's good and the you getting was as good believe. as it was gonna get. Well, I appreciate you guys letting us know that my bowl came down over here. Hey, uh, <laughs> he said, there's a nice one, there's a nice one, he's getting ready. He's, he's, like, got, oh, he's got a spot on him, all of a sudden he said, Bonk. <laughs> dead. <laughs> The caribou action was really fast again, but as usual, Ralph has to wait to the last day, to the last minute, to shoot his caribou. And the plan? 
The plan is if the wind holds up, if the wind doesn't, you're going to see me and my skivvies, skivvies jumping in and getting him out here, getting him over here. Welcome back. This next hunt was with Gary Cornum from Beeman. You know, it was a guy's only hunt. Kind of I'm starting to like a little more. And uh, <laughs> we headed up to northern Saskatchewan with Marlon Taze of Northern Boreal Trophy Hunts. And I'll tell you what, it was incredible. But more than anything, we told Gary, Gary, get tight on the bear when he was filming. And I said, tight, tight. But I didn't think he would get this tight. It's been incredible. I cannot wait to get Vicky up here because she will shoot like the big blonde and I'll have to live with that, but that's all right. I, I'm just thrilled as I can be to be hunting here with uh, Marlin Taves, uh, Northern Boreal Outfitters. It's just been incredible. First day, we're going to go back out tonight. Ralph's going to do some hunting, and I am just excited to see what else we can find. Lo and behold, the last hour, or not even, of our first day here at McMillan River. Hey, Joel, how close do you need that 200-inch bull to you? I mean, come on, all the pins were on him. this beard too. Beautiful, beautiful bird. All of a sudden, I look up and there's this big boar bedded down in the group. We didn't even know he was there. And uh, I'm like, 
Fred, there's a big boar here. <laughs> uh, so let's wait on him. They come walking right, right by us. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Wait. Oh, brother Fred, you did it again. You got a second pair of for you. Ralph, Vicky, thank you so much. The guys at Bullseye, George and Russ, for setting us up on this hunt. Saskatchewan black bears, baby. There is nothing like it. Yeah, at least you got a couple this year. I actually shot more ducks and geese than you this fall. No, you didn't, And, Vicky. Vicky. and I Vicky. shot a deer in North Dakota, and you didn't. So don't even start because this year I really, really did well you know, out there I in the field. I dedicated this fall, this past fall, to help you out more. Like at Double B up in North Dakota, I filmed you. I was trying to help you out. I was trying to guide you and, and counsel you through all of your no, hunting I don't think that's what you did. I just think I had better shot placement on the gun shots and you know I just I How I'm, could you I'm have better one. shot placement when you shoot a scatter gun? It's like a five a foot scatter gun. Yeah, I mean it's a shotgun. It was a tradition. It was an over and under. I like that gun. You got lucky. It's because Freddie was calling them in so close. I mean you could actually hit oh, him with yeah. the barrel. Oh yeah, now you're what, you paying Freddie money now? No, but I mean come on. Yeah, okay, let's just roll the footage. David just came and picked us up. We're gonna go right in here and go pick up my buck. Come on, let's go. was committing suicide and you still didn't shoot him. What's up with that? Good shot. Sure, it was a good thing Travis came up with me up to Alberta because Ralph was no help with shooting any bears up there.
Colorado Bucks on the ground by you know who. And what Vic get? Nothing. He is at 10. <laughs> huh? A good B wide? Okay. Welcome back to the Archer's Choice. Now these next hunts are up at Lost River Outfitters. And it's Tim and Shirley Strickland and of course Tony Parmanian, one of the posse members. You have to check out these hunts. I know you guys are going to want to see the whole hunt, but Shirley... You go, girl. Go shoot that bigger bear than the rest of the guys. What do you think, kiddo? Oh, man. That's a big fat boar. Casey, look at the size of this boar. And look at, look at his the hair. hair. Look at it. All that. I've never seen hide this thick and woolly. Last night in Saskatchewan, it's about 4.30 p.m. I got very lucky tonight, had a real nice bear came in, put it on him, made it up the hill about 25 yards. Our bear's laying right there. Yes. Today's November the fourteenth. It's our first night here in South Dakota and he is down right there. Yeah, baby. Thank you. Woo, we got a great year to come oh, up I'm ahead, telling don't you, we? We are so excited and we hope you are too after watching the preview show to realize what all's coming on this year on the Archer's Choice. We've got a lot of great footage and a lot of great hunts and some fun too. Oh yeah, on my account. Of course, but that's what the fun part is. Oh yeah, sure. But we also want to thank all of your viewers and our sponsors because because of you guys, without you, this without you, have been possible. our goal, our dream would never have been possible. Like you said, no, we won the Outdoor Channel Fan Favorite Hunting Show, and it's because <sighs> of you. And we appreciate it so much. We want to thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. We realize we're blessed, and we're blessed to have all of you supporting us. Because without you, we wouldn't have Archer's Choice. No, none of this no. would be possible. So we want you to tune in next week, same time, same channel, right here on, on the, the Archer's, Archer's Choice. Choice.